I love taking showers. In fact, I've taken thousands of showers my entire life. So I wanted to find out what this Nebbia thing is all about. My name is Philip Winter, and I'm the co-founder and CEO of Nebbia. On average, Americans take about eight minutes to shower. For the normal shower, that's over 20 gallons of water. For the Nebbia, it's only six. That's 70% less water. What goes into actually atomizing this water so it uses less, but also just covers your whole body? I mean, when we started working on this, we looked at sort of other areas that we could sort of pull from and learn from. In atomizing water, we're leveraging sort of a technology that's been around for, in some cases, a century. And it's always used in industrial applications, in jet engines, internal combustion engines, in agriculture, always for different purposes. Essentially what we're doing is, is taking water, passing it through a nozzle that has different geometries, and creating millions of much smaller droplets. Um, and it creates a surface area of water that's like 10x a regular shower. That's why you get this sort of much more efficient use of water and this very like soft sensation. Can you talk about, you know, just the mentality of, there's so many iterations that we won't even see, yeah. but what, what went into that process as well for you guys? Hey man, we worked with so many different ideas and played with the idea of color and different materials. And we sort of looked at everything that's in the bathroom and everything in the bathroom is like chrome. Um, and it's been that way for decades. And we said, you know, we could do chrome or we could do something a little bit different. Um, and we chose anodized bead blasted finish, mm -hmm. which is sort of what you see on MacBooks. Um, Familiar but different in the bathroom. Are you guys playing with any other ideas of kind of like a deluxe edition? You know, as, as things evolve, like what's going on in your minds with that? Additional features will be things that really add value. Uh, and they'll probably be in future generations. So you can track how much water you use and how much energy you use. In the future, we'll design the faucets. So you can like pick your temperature and it just stays there. Right? You don't have to every morning sort of guess. And I think that will sort of be the most interesting thing. So if I like am listening and paying attention, it sounds like you're alluding to like smart features built in conjunction with the Nebbia for future iterations or even the first one coming out would be able to talk to that. For future iterations. Yeah. yeah. At the end of the day, the proof is always in the pudding of someone actually trying the shower out. We're, we're gonna check it out, but how would you describe your first Nebbia experience? You'll see for yourself. It's, we always tell people, look, you gotta try for yourself, you'll get it. What's up guys? Welcome to my shower. Uh, you can see over here, this is the Nebbia prototype. We've seen what the final ID looks like outside. And I've gotta tell you, I have taken thousands of showers, but I have never taken a Nebbia, so I wanna see what it feels like. I will tell you, it feels like this is the softest shower I've had for sure. Alright, I gotta say, coming into this, I didn't know what to expect from the shower. I thought the water pressure would not be strong enough, but you know, it feels great. It covers your whole body. It doesn't feel like you're missing anything. And I gotta say, I'm super excited when the Nebbia comes out. This thing is tight. Oh, this is dope. Now it's warm. This is good. 